Welcome to the first episode of my weekly recap. So first thing first, we would have to go to the on the fourth. That was on Monday of the week which was just concluded. As if you can see, I was using my ranges to track the current market structure so that I would know exactly what to do immediately get to my trading period at 7 a.m. New York time. But as you can see on Monday, there was no trade. I was expecting price to sweep the liquidity at the top before a break of structure. But it did not do that. I just had to like stay behind and watch the market to do its thing. So we we'll fast forward to on the 5th, that's on Tuesday. You can see, same thing. I was using my, my ranges to track the market structure. Seriously using my ranges to track the market structure. So I did not place any trade because I did not see a clear sweep of liquidity. I just had to like let it be. So we moved on the sixth. That's on Wednesday. I always make sure I track my market structure using my ranges you get so if you can see this there was a sweep of liquidity but there was no break of structure okay. on Wednesday there was no trade then we'll move on to on the 7th that's on Thursday if you can see same thing I was using my ranges to track the current market structure then if, if you can see from here, there was a sweep of liquidity. You can see it before, there is, before the break of structure. So if, immediately I saw that, I just had to like... I brought out my Fibonacci tool to mark out my optimal trade entry. That's what gave me these entry points. And I had to use the nearest 5 volt points to my entry for my stop loss. You can see. So that's how I got it. Then I targeted this previous section I as my take profit. So, so that's um, one to five risks to reward for this trade. I shared this trade on my te free Telegram group. So if you're interested, I'll drop the link in the bio or in the description. Sorry to say. So, if you're interested, you can just click on it so that you'll join us to trade. I share educational content in there. And there's a lot of other things you get to like benefit. We do give away like a lot of cool things in there. So, I'll be adding the link to my Telegram channel to in the description of the video. Then, that was on Thursday. It's got our take profits on Friday morning. Then, if you can see, on Friday, I was also tracking the current market structure using the range. That's the best way I believe anybody can track the current market structure. So, if you can observe from here, there was a sweep of liquidity. After my, the opening of my trading section, there was a sweep of liquidity over here. And there was a break of structure. Like, I just, how I simply navigated the market. Now I simply navigate the market. Simple and easy. Simple and easy. Simple and easy. Simple and easy. So I just had to like bring out my Fibonacci to Asia. This was this. You can see this is my Fibonacci optimal trade entry 0 0.618. So I just had to like put my entry here and my stop loss to the most nearest private point closest to my entry so that was it i did not share the signal because i saw no need to share i just didn't plan to like take any trade that friday so i did not share the signal but it was very very valid one to eight i targeted the eye of the previous section so it's a one to eight trade. So that's it for my weekly recap for week 
04 to 08 September 2023. Until we meet next time, stay safe.